what happened in your journey? Like, um, how did you like become an atheist? Like, at what point did you realize that Islam is not for you? Like, take us through that. Yeah. Okay. Um, so growing up, I was all about, you know, fairness and justice. I think perhaps it can be kind of like a childish concept as well. Of like, oh, it's not fair. Um, so I, I remember one particular moment was always standing out in mind was I could never understand why, you know, the my lovely neighbor who's not Muslim is going to burn in hell for all eternity. But the imam who beats his wife and cheats on her, he's going to go to Jannah because at the end of the day, yeah, he might go to Jahannam because he's sinned a little bit, but eventually he's going to go to Jannah because he was a Muslim and he believed in Allah. Yeah. And so that sort of stuff started like, you know, sitting in, the, in my head and I was like, this doesn't make sense. I don't I kind of agree with it. Probably one of the biggest failings my parents ever did was encourage me to ask why. <laughs> so, I would ask why I'm like why do I have to wear a hijab and my brothers don't have to wear a hijab why do um why can't I raise my voice when I'm in the house if there's men in the house but my brother can raise his if there's women in the house I kind of kept up the image of a good Muslima and it wasn't until I was about 15 years old which is when my sister passed away in an accident and um I you know I remember I was there with her because I found her and I was like hang on like this is a child. This child has done nothing wrong, like absolutely nothing. And I couldn't wrap that around my head why he would take a two-year-old, but he won't take murderers, he won't take rapists, he won't take pedophiles, he won't take all these people who do deserve to die, in a sense. Why would he be taking this child? Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.